had a subscriber hit me up, said, I used it for evil every Friday night, 10 p.m. It texts every girl on my phone, what are you doing? <laughs> Finance family, it's the other brother Adam Git Bags, and today I'm going to be showing you how to send SMS messages through the email to SMS gateway in Python. So we can just quickly flip over to the script. All my scripts are on my GitHub. I'll just walk you through it, and then we'll show you what you need to know as we go. So first, we're just going to import a couple imports, and these should come with your Python distribution. Next, I'm importing my email, my gateway address, and my app key. Now, your email is just your email that you want to send the messages from, and then your gateway address is the recipient address. So I'll show you how to find gateway addresses for all different kinds of phone numbers uh, from different carriers. And then last is the app key, and we're going to pass that with our email address so that we can send emails. Now, I'm using Google, so I'll show you how to set that up with your Gmail account. So first, we're going to create an email message, and then here we're going to set the content of our message. Obviously, we're going to get a bag, so let's fucking go. Next, we have our from. This is going to be our sender email, so it's going to be your email that you're sending. And then here's your gateway address, and it's the recipient phone number. So essentially, it's just a 10-digit phone number, and then it's a carrier domain. So here we'll just quickly Google search email to SMS domains, scroll down. Here's a list of email to SMS addresses. Then here you can scroll through this list or you can look up the carrier here in alphabetical order. So let's just say we want to do some T-Mobile or something like that. Then here we have T-Mobile. So you're going to be your 10 digit phone number here. And then here's going to be your carrier domain. And then for example, Verizon, you have a 10 digit number and then you have your carrier domain right here. So back on your script, these are just gonna be strings. Then we have our subject line of your email, but we're gonna be sending this as an SMS message. So it looks like here we're creating our SMTP server. We're starting that TLS encryption. And then here we have our sender email, and then we have our app key, but we need to figure out how to get that app key. So here we are on our Google account. Let's go ahead and click into Google Apps. Let's go to the account here. Then we'll go to security. So here on the security page, just go ahead and type app password. So once you're here on app passwords, just create a new app name, create the app that will give you your app key. That's going to be 16 characters long. Copy that. You can paste it in your script. One thing about these app passwords is they're less secure than using other forms of two factor authentication. And also if you have two factor authentication turned on your account, you can't just find this app passwords menu on the security page there. So once you have that, copy the key over. So for good measure, I'll send one of these messages out. There you go, pretty nice. Just like that, now you can send SMS messages for free using the email to SMS gateway in Python. And please do not use your powers for evil. Had a subscriber hit me up, said I used it for evil every Friday night, 10 p.m. It texts every girl on my phone, what are you doing? Guess I can't save them all.